How much have you guys been thinking about security in today's crazy world? City reeling from a holiday weekend of gun violence with police reporting dozens of shootings with a total of 56 victims. And these crowds kept growing, the tensions eventually boiling over. That's something we're gonna be talking about today and it has never been more important than it is today. Everybody's going crazy. So it would be prudent to start thinking about security now. It's a new life. All right, guys, before I get into the video, um, I want to talk about a few a few tips on security when you're living in your RV, traveling. Um, a few things that I've found that work. If you're out at a campsite, like just in the middle of nowhere, it's nice to get those solar uh, lights that have motion detection on them. Um, those are pretty cool. You know, when you're out in the middle of nowhere, those, those help. Um, Another thing is when people come and knock on your RV, um, it's it's a good idea if you don't know them to answer answer from a window, open a window or something, and say how can I help you? You know what do you want and stuff, and feel them out a little bit before you open up your door because otherwise they can come in and uh, there can always be somebody around the corner as well um, waiting that you can't really see. So you want to be prudent about that. Another thing uh, for keeping your belongings secure, I've noticed with RVs that a lot of the keys for your under your storage underneath, they actually fit other RVs um, storage compartments as well. So you may want to change out your key cords for your storage. Um, you could also actually change the uh, lock on your door as well. And of course, there's fire alarms. Keep a fire alarm in there. We There are uh, remote computers now that you can get from um, Walmart and, and off, off of Amazon where you can check on your RV when you're not there, when you're out about in your uh, pull behind, just checking out town. You can always just uh, look up on your phone and check up on your your animals or what whatnot um a lot of you have seen uh me do that in my videos i always check up on my dog and uh when i'm not there for my wi-fi cameras so yeah just different security options like that now let's get into the video what's going on guys so i gotta tell you something i was scrolling facebook like about a month ago and I saw an ad for this company called Body Armor Direct, and I saw that they had this uh, 3A rated uh, body armor, which looked just like a shirt. It's absolutely incredible. I couldn't believe it because most of the time when I've seen body armor, it's just huge and bulky, and it's like, yeah, that dude is totally wearing uh, some body armor. Well, this company has, has a new VIP shirt. Um, and you can't even really tell that you're that you're wearing it. I'm wearing kind of a tight shirt, but but check it out. I'm wearing I'm wearing it right now. You can wear a regular shirt over it. Um, it looks great. You can barely tell that you're even wearing it. It's super light. There's no really heavy metal plates in it or anything like that. It's just lightweight. Um, now the thing is, is you're supposed to wear this for about two to three weeks so it will conform to your body i have not done that yet so you might notice a little um little areas where you can tell where it's where it's at and stuff but yeah this is it awesome i could wear this all day but the most important thing is does it work right so i've got another one right here this one's an extra large actually and we've got a watermelon in there, so we're gonna have to try to shoot it below this crease here. Um, the vest will fly off, unless, do you want it, should we, one of us wear one and then test it out, or? You can do that, if you want. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, not a good idea, okay, okay. So, uh, just to show you guys that we're not gonna be using blanks or anything, got a couple bottles of water here we're gonna 
shoot first. So I've got my buddy here. Um, he uh, he did four years in the Marine Corps, uh, two tours in Iraq. So he's very well versed in body armor and ballistics, um, guns, stuff, you know, all that type of stuff. The fun stuff. <laughs> the fun stuff, yeah. We are going to be using his 45 kill. Yep. It's a Smith & Wesson M&P shield. Um, it's my... It's a very nice pistol. We're going to be using um, ballpoint. Oh my goodness. And uh, <laughs> look at the size of those bullets. So this the, this is rated 3A, not level 3, but 3A. So it it, uh, it will protect against any, uh, it won't protect against rifle shots, but any, it's just a handgun pretty much, um, it'll, it'll protect you from the real vital parts, right? We need to, someday maybe we'll get a whole suit and, and head coverage. It'll just be totally bulletproof like a sentinel. <laughs> so let's give this a shot. We're going to do uh, two shots into this. Just be aware this this thing is going to fall more than likely when we shoot it uh, because there's pretty much nothing holding it on there. So let's give it a shot. I will film Paul when he... Uh, Shoots one right here into the bottle first, and then one into the vest here, and then we'll have to probably set it up again, and then I'll do the same thing. He'll he'll uh, film me while I shoot the bottle first, and then the vest. All right, let's get this loaded up. Two rounds. Yeah. All right, we are hot. Woo! Look at that. <laughs> oh. Uh. Yeah, I went through that puppy. Oh. Or maybe it just cracked it. <laughs> no. It deflected it. Yeah, so the bullet must still be in there. Yep. Right yeah, there. the bullet's right there. Oh my gosh, I thought it didn't work for a second. <laughs> I oh was like, gosh, we're going to have to not make this video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I was going to show it either way. Oh my gosh, you can feel it right there. It went right through this Velcro. Okay. But yeah, it's oh, in there. You can see it. I see it. it. Yep. It's still hot. <laughs> wow, that would hurt so much though. It would save your life, but... We'll have to cut that out of there. Oh um, gosh, that would be a Oh, you, there is a hell. zipper. Zipper right here. Oh, okay. Let me uh, pull this off. There we go. You can see it went Look right at through the zipper here. Look at that. Oh right yeah. The, it did. The Velcro. Look at that. Whoa. It just <laughs> flattened it. <laughs> that's it. Nothing. Oh my gosh. Nothing through the other but side. But look what it did to the watermelon. Man. That would hurt. So yeah, you would be in pain, but you would also be protected. You wouldn't have that in your stomach. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So um, we're going to set this all up again. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> that is incredible, isn't it? It was able to stop something that is moving that crazy. fast. Yeah, that is good. That is good stuff. I mean, you saw it. Oh, it was yeah. just hanging right off the... It right. went in there. So I forgot to talk about that. A lot of body armor that you can buy... Um, you know on the internet and all that a lot of it's made in China But this company actually they've got everything certified here in America. That's actually a huge deal to look for is being certified um, And I'm of course gonna have a link in the description below for a little bit of a, a deal if you want to get one yourself and uh, Just click on the link below But let's set this up again Let's turn the water that is it's like <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna be in pain <laughs> yeah but you won't be bleeding internally 
Yes, you will not be bleeding. All right, we took about five minutes to just go, whoa, you know, and, and examine it a little bit further. Here you go. Got two rounds in there. And uh, we are hot. Meg is cleared. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we did to the watermelon. <laughs> it's pretty much done. But let's see if we can recover that other bullet. All right. Oh, there's uh there's straps on the inside here. Oh, we forgot to zip that back up. There it is. Did not penetrate. Look at that. Right there, I gotta push from the other side. Gosh, that is in there. <laughs> but it stopped a bullet. <laughs> That's incredible. Oh. Okay. This is, yeah, 45 is about as big as you can get with a handgun. Look at that. And I've already got this other one that I saved from Paul's shot. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. Terry, let's go this way. Try it this way more. I feel that. It's just a little... <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, you would definitely be in pain, but you would not be dead. Unbelievable. Those were. How could inch something and a half so apart. thin? Inch and a half apart. Can you believe how thin it's that is? Still, the integrity is good. Yeah, the integrity is perfect. You have a stomach ache, but. Yeah. So, there you guys go. Um, I was talking to the owner. The owner's a really cool dude. He's he is really dedicated to um to his craft. Um and yeah. Definitely check out his company. If you're interested, I've got a limited time discount going on right now. Just click on the link in the description below and uh check it out. The best body armor. Look at this. I'm, I'm of course wearing a, this is probably the most loose fitting shirt I've got. You can wear a dress shirt or something with it. Yeah. Woo! Won't even see it. Peace out guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Hey guys, living on the road full time in my RV can bring me on some pretty crazy adventures. I encourage you to follow along in my adventures on the road, so please subscribe to my channel, share my videos, and thanks for watching.